Hello there and welcome back to Control. Last time I took on the Ashtray Maze and failed miserably because I am not smart enough to get through that just yet. I am going back to it later on and see if I can make heads or tails of it. I also tried to do a few executive orders. Killing people, high profile targets, I failed those. I did succeed in protecting some personnel, but for now I am in the research section, sector research, trying to find Marshall because she seems to know more about our brother Dylan. And we also found out, not last time but before that, that the thing in our head is some kind of being, which Jesse named Polaris in honor of the guiding star in the night sky. And uh, that's when Dylan disappeared and she's been searching for Dylan ever since and um, we're here now. I have no idea what's going on. But uh, let's go, notice. Multiple hazards, no admittance for unauthorized persons. That... Is that something? Hmm, that's kind of a some sort of. I was going to say that looks like some sort of cityscape first, but no. Sure, those look like buildings, but that looks like the last level in a your in any kind of RPG, really. What's this? A floating sphere shining light on something and... Is that? Maybe. Fine. Hey, more classified papers. Unread. All right, the astral exhibition. It was originally built for ast astronauts. Instead of astronauts, people who go into the astral space to explore, I guess. He uses a training location. Please don't go question to the site. Astral plane. He decided to repurpose the place, similar to how Zeus hope familiar surroundings will affect the well-being of the animals. We hope so. so no. New naming conventions have been established for the astral entity now known as Astral Spike. Who the hell is Astral Spike? Also, there was actually one thing I wanted to check. Or the counter measures. Oh, I do have a few of those. Hmm. Kill enemies with a service weapon in charge mode. Charge into the field. It's the art commercial of war. Can I accept multiple of these at a time? Let's try it. Shatter maneuvers. I don't have shatter. Spin mode. Sure. I do have that one. His cards. Kill his cards in the executive sector using spin. Sure. Executive incursion, kill enemies in the executive section. Sector. Section. Sector. Sure. Oh, I can only have three active at a time. And if I take away one, it disappears. Kill enemies in the executive sector with headshots. Oh, I am not that good. Kill enemies, sure, but. Uh, Spin mode. Yeah, might as well do this then. Using peers. Ah. Too many things. Let's see. Spin mode. Normal mode. Don't know if that's charge moon matching. And here we have two darling urgent review. Two marshal. Two darling review. Sure. 
sure. Ooh. File these to darning. Yeah. Let's move on. Actually, who is... What the? Oh, I that's a... I can't believe they keep that thing here. That thing? What is that thing? Oh, hello. Are you coming for me? You are coming for me. Gotcha. You know. What am I supposed to do against you? Not shoot you, that's for sure. That's a lot of flashing. What does this do? Nothing? Yeah, I saw another cube over there. Let me get to it. Oh. What am I actually supposed to do? Okay, I see that now. Okay. Are the cubes still around? Or did I break them? Oh, there's one. Anyway. I want the cube, damn it. And the other cube, which I threw. There you are. Uh, no! I already did that one. Wait. What am I doing? I don't know. I'm pressing buttons. Oh, I am I. Okay. Am I supposed to lurk in there? Whoop. I can maybe do that. Whoa. That hurt. What was the Bureau doing with that thing? Don't know. But it hurt a lot. Hmm. Did I miss my chance to go through that door? Oh, because that would just go around to this one, I think. Okay, so it's trapped in there now. Good, good, good. Don't know what it was. Someone answer, damn it! We need backup down here. Hello, it's me. Marshall, are you still there? Shit. Yes, not. We're so close. We need to hurry. Parapsychology hypnosis lab, extrasensory lab. Bring you with me. His clusters heal other enemies, destroy them to make the fight easier. Okay, and what's the his cluster? Die. I guess you're in the cluster? Another chair guy. And, uh... Nope. Nope, you take your damn grenades back. Oh, there you are. I can't do anything with that. Is that a... Yep. Why didn't you move, though? Uh, 
Yeah, I can feel ya. Ooh, that's a lot of... And where did you go? people <laughs> that's so gruesome oh. I want to keep killing you with my spin spin oh, oh that's a big one nope So far, so good. Where did you go? the only dangerous ones, you are not dangerous. Because you only lob grenades. You lob a lot of grenades though. Ten out of ten. Done. Wait, I can use you as well? Oh. You're a big boy. Wait. Oh, I thought that said control research. Nope, just said central. Astral exhibition that way, extra sensor lab. Down? Eh. Maybe down over there? Yeah, you know, that's the hypnosis lab. Central research parakinesiology. Isn't that what I went through to get there here? Yeah, I went through parakinesiology to get up here. And if I go down... Hmm. I don't want to go to the parapsychology yet. But maybe I will be forced to, because it doesn't look like I will be... Ooh, able to go to the extra sensory or the hypnosis labs. It's this! Ugh. Precognitive powers? This cluster. Oh, okay. Those are the clusters. The teleporting dudes. His clusters are unique in that they are concentrated manifestations of his resonance without the need of a host. His clusters are dense spherical compressions of his resonance that serve support functions in the hierarchy of his entities. The clusters are capable of replenishing his hosts with infusions of resonance, aka healing. Kind of. This does not heal any physical damage inflicted on the organic host, but rather seems to rejuvenate them, allowing them to endure more bodily harm than normally possible. So rejuvenation and not actual healing. The fact that the Hiss makes an effort to preserve its corrupted host underlines a level of awareness and discretion that was previously just speculation on my part. Can this entity be considered an individual or simply an extension of the Hiss encounter? Correspondence, precognitive powers. 
Nadine, send this research analysis rewrite. Dr. Darling, urgent? I had a dream. In the dream, I was just given the solution to a suffering problem which sent me just yesterday. I can only draw the... Okay. Okay, so if I read this right... Yesterday... You got a staffing problem, and the night to yesterday you had a dream. In which case it might be precognitive powers, unless this reads more like yesterday I got a staffing problem, and the night to today I dreamt up a solution, because that's kind of normal. No. Oh, they are open. They had angry red blockers on them before. So, hypnosis lab. Let's go there first. Yep. Seek shelter. Hi. What's going on? I see it. Another object of power? They're just standing there. Mesmerized by it. Find a way into the room to bind the X-ray light box. Yeah, because you aren't wearing those Hadron things, so you should be his agents. You are definitely hypnotized. By that thing. X-ray light box, huh? Can you... Is there an explanation for this object of power somewhere, or... Will I, as usual, find it three rooms from now? No, don't care. I am doing stuff. Yeah. Maybe this one. Astronauts information, no. That's... This report serves as an introductory guide to the astronaut program, including candidate requirements, training practices, and astral research procedures. Astronauts, that feels weird to say, are chosen individuals who explore and document the astral plane by making physical contact with the X-ray light box in the hypnosis lab, a section of the parapsychology div division. Physical and psychological training is vital for the repeated transition between planes, known as dives. After each dive, astronauts must undergo a... something session in the cognitive recording chairs to record their experience in the plane. Wait, cognitive recording chair? That's this one. Legs up here, head into machine. No, thank you. What's this? Oh. Control unit, up, down, up, right. I'm sorry, what? It was kind of a hexagon and kind of a three-dimensional cube as well. Am I supposed to find a clue about that somewhere? Something I overlooked? This is a dead end.
lock controlled remotely, so I guess that puzzle unlocks this door. Doesn't help. Nothing I can see. Oh, there it is. Okay, so much up top, but nothing otherwise. There we go. That wasn't that difficult. You're still hypnotized? You are probably going to wake up as soon as I bind that object to me, aren't you? Yeah, I have a feeling. Please state your name for the record. Paul Warren, Astral Mark, First Class. Astral you are aware that exposure to the astral plane can result in death, disability, personal injury, corporeal entangling, cognitive collapse. Oh, just waking up can result in death. To full dimension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am. And you acknowledge that your use of the astral conduit, aka the X ray light box, is You sound purely like you've been. Yes, I do. have given Perfect. this speech plenty of times. Okay, you're all set. Open the door for Mr. Warren, please. <laughs> you sound quite bored. Sound like you expect him to die, which he probably did. Okay, so 1973. Wait, okay. Why did that? Yeah. Games. Alright, another astral plane training. Use C's to complete the astral plane challenge. Sure. If you would tell me what C's is, I would gladly do that. <laughs> Enemies with low health can be seized. Yes, and? And? <laughs> ah, time to look up the controls, I guess. Because this regular power is just launch. Unless I use that to seize as well. Uh, shield launch evade. Crouch and crown slam. Well, I guess... I guess it's seizing. Launching. Hi, I'm here now. Um, you're gonna send me some enemies, or...? Thank you. Up. Oh. What? Hold E to seize enemies, huh? Seize enemies will fight. Okay, so... Takes a while to charge up. But sure. Go fight, people! I am your new overlord. Obey me. Or despair.
And at least you stand still while I'm seizing. I will still have to be behind cover, I think. That feels like the safest way. And if I press E2 first, I switch forms. anywhere near the gold guy. Oh. And I'm not quite sure what the range and the seas is yet. Oh. You seem low enough. And I can seize you there-ish. Go kill the golden boy. There we go. Good work slash playing director. You have been approved. Exchange now about validated. That was fast. Yeah, okay. And, um... Where is my exit? There is my exit. So now people... People... His agents can be my playthings, and you all died. Were you that shocked when I bound the object to me? Mm. Your brains were fried when I took over the object. Thank you for explaining. How did you know their brains fried, though? Are you a medical expert? Ooh, Rorschach tests. That's definitely a an evil bug of some sort, stretching out his hands, or its hands. This is just a weird face. Eyes there, nose and nose ridge here, and weird teeth there. This is... Some kind of crab. Legs go there, eyes up there, and these are the claws. Hey, that's another crab. Claws, claws. Oh, those are your eyes, though. And you're holding a bra for some reason. That's just a weird face with four eyes. <laughs> that was the hypnosis lab. What's in the extrasensory lab? Another object of power? Or just evil people? So many doors. Too quiet. Wait, is that... I thought that looked, uh, looked like a printer first. But it wasn't. Sensory tank purpose. Darling here, some of you were curious why I had the sensory dip, dip oh, sensory deprivation tanks. Ugh. Maybe some of you heard about Dr. Yoshimi Tokui? Tokui? The man behind the hugely popular guided imagery. Last time I heard about a sensory deprivation tank, I was watching Fringe. Sure hope you don't use the tanks here for the same reason they use it there. Okay, the x-ray light box. The object is a light box used to determine x-ray images. Duh. The image cannot be removed from the light box. Okay, so it's permanently set. The information on the image belongs to a patient named something. Probably not important. The objects allow para-utilitarians to forcefully seize an individual's, let's say, mind. The seized individual becomes subservient, I guess, ish. Uh, that's too long a word, but sure, to the user. The effect lasts probably until death. No, not until death. One, because once released, the seized smear as a result of the psychic trauma. 
The seas dies, I guess. Kind of like because that's how the all the people who were staring at the light box died. So this definitely kills people, which doesn't matter. I'm I would probably kill, just kill them anyway. Acquisition date two thousand and three. Okay, so the extrasensory lab had the information about the object of power in the hypnosis lab. Right. Were you using these for something else than trying to determine precognitive abilities? Is this some sort of code for you? Oops. That's a lot of red dots. Dr. Tukui, investigation. Dr. Yoshimi Tukui, a Japanese citizen residing in Tokyo, has produced a series of guided imagery experience audio recordings that have gained notable popularity around the globe. Due to his, un his unusually swift rise in fame, along with the reports of vivid something accompanying the use of his tapes, investigation sector staff were asked to look into, look into Dr. Tukui's background. We found no past incident with an altered occurrence, nor any evidence of involvement with an altered organization. However, agents that attended a signing event reported hearing something, seeing something, when hearing Dr. Tukui speak. We recommend that the Bureau team obtain an audio recording of Dr. Dr. Tukui's, Tukui's? I don't know how to pronounce that, I'm not Japanese. His voice and perform any and all relevant analysis. Based on the findings, the investigation sector will determine the next steps regarding, regarding the dear doctor, as well as his eligibility for the prime candidate program. What the hell is a prime candidate? Someone who might be next in line to be director, maybe? I guess this would be... No? I thought that would be a tape of Dr. Tukui. <coughs> oh, sheesh. Sorry. Voice is slightly better, but still acts up now and then. <clears throat> Anything in this big room? Ooh. Ah, the sensory deprivation tanks. Holy hell, that's a small tank. If you don't have claustrophobia, you will have after spending some time in that. Sheesh. And I thought iron lungs were bad. Wait. Can I listen to this one? No. You are not going to let me listen to the doctor, are you? Okay. Fine. I've done what I came here to do. Explore and find a new object of power to me. That's enough for me. I can now force people to do my bidding. Or, well, in this case, force people to shoot other people. Shoot the people I perceive to be bad. And I didn't notice this before, but this is just a dissected brain. That kind of looks like an alien. Ooh. Goodies. Spin grouping efficiency. Okay. Groupthink. Uh, this study extends the work of Irving Janis, Robert Barron, and others by proposing strong casual links between groupthink and the passive or active use of telepathy. To prove these connections, the parapsychology department carried out variations of Solomon Ash, 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 Ash 
original conformity experiments using a telepathic individual as the subject. See other experiments for details. Extensive qualitative and quantitative data resulting from these experiments were then used to identify telepathic interference within the group. Further empirical findings suggest measures can be taken to safeguard against telepathic influence on behaviors by engaging in something. Rather boldly, this paper stands to revolutionize the as a group think theory and provide new data. That's a lot of background. Don't know how or if that's gonna be relevant. And. Ooh. Collect reward. Weapon mod. Oh, and pick up a new one, I guess. Research incursion. His snipers. Yeah, gimme. Oh. Yeah, don't care about that one. Don't really want that one. Maintenance incursion. Yeah. No. 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 Kill his agents in the research center sector using. Why do I want to say center? It's sector. It's either it's either center or section. It's sector. Uh, kill rangers using abilities. I might be able to remember that. Don't know why I still have these because I am not in the executive sector and I am not going there yet. Kill his snipers, sure, because those bastards keep showing up. And demolition experts, sure. Demolition burst malignant does not translate. Shield does. Distance is foreign, ground and distant. We do not approve. Abilities, object skills are the greatest assets. Proud. I really want to know what the hell the board is. Or are. Or what kind of, yeah, what kind of entity it is. Anyway, I think I'm going to leave it up there. So... Thank you for being here, and you take care of yourself now. See ya.